<laughs> well, that's for dinner on Afternoon Express today. And because it's the weekend, it's time for us to get into our Web Whiz Quiz. <laughs> our contestants today, Genie D and Masasa. How are you guys feeling? How well do you know the internet, Masas? I, I don't. At this all. is going to be exciting. Do you use it? I try to. All right, we find out about your social media usage. I have to tell usage. you a story. Mm. Yesterday, I was talking to my goddaughter, who's four years old, and she was scratching. So I said, "Have you got allergies?" So she said, "Yes." I said, "What are you allergic to?" So she said, "Either milk or the iPad." So I said, "What part of the iPad mm. are you allergic to?" She said. YouTube. <laughs> That's so cute. That's so cute. awesome. <laughs> Alright, we're going to have lots of fun on the show today. The rules are very simple. There's six internet based questions with multiple choice answers. First person to get the uh, correct answer needs to hit the buzzer and share the answer. And after you give the answer, our resident uh, open serve technician and internet expert will provide us with the correct answer. So let's meet her. Good afternoon. I'm Pretty Kumalo. I'm your resident open serve technician. We all use the internet every day. But how much do we really know about it? Let's find out and good luck. Good luck to the both of you. Let's get into our first question for today. You at home can play with us as we'll try and see how quickly you and your families can answer these questions. Question number one is, what do these three things have in common? Fiber technology, satellite technology, and cellular technology. Your options, Jeannie, before you answer, are A, they are all wireless technologies, B, they are all South African inventions. C, they are all telecommunication technologies. Or D, they are all used, or they all are used exclusively in the medical field. Which one is correct? A, they're all wireless technologies. Jeannie's going for the answer of A. Masasa, are you agreeing or I disagreeing? I would totally agree with A. A. Then you've got to be faster than me on the Sorry, buzzer. I'm winning that point. Pressure! <laughs> well, either way, the answer is not A. It is, in fact, C. They are all telecommunication technologies. Let's find out more. They are all telecommunication technologies. These are technologies that are used for different purposes depending on the requirements. Our technicians at OpenServe have the depth of skill and expertise to work in these areas, as well as other ICT-related fields. But surely it's all wireless. <laughs> well, kind of, I guess so. Uh, but we've got, that's a great start to the competition, by the way. Let's get to question two. It is on the screen, and it is, what does FIFTH stand for? What, or FTTH, I was said FIFTH. What does FTTH stand for? Is it A, fast time to home? B, fiber to the home? C, fiber to the hospital? Or D, fast track to help? Uh, is this, no, I'm <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, B? My sauce is going with B, fiber to the home. The correct answer is in fact B! Yeah! yeah wait, it's what is it? It's fiber to the home. Well done, my sauce. That's a good, good guess. Let's go find out more from our technician. Sure. FTTH stands for fiber to the home. This acronym refers to the installation and then use of fiber optic cables from the central point directly to an individual building, such as a home or business park. <laughs> so it's one point, Masasa, nil to Genie. And that first question kind of, I should take a point away from you, but I won't. I won't. <laughs> you're I'll a just, nice person. I'm a nice person, <laughs> yes. and you're a guest in the loft Absolutely. today. Absolutely. Let's get into question number three. It's on your screen. It is, which one of these does not belong in the group? Is it A, 3G, B, 2G, C, LTE, or D, FTTH? That's obvious. Oh, who tapped we, it first? Both of us have tapped that sand. first. We yeah. both tapped that. It's <laughs> awkward. Okay, let's, I'll give you guys 50 50 percent of the vote. Then, what are you both going to say? Reveal your answer in three, two, one. D. D. Oh, Jeannie's taking on D. That is indeed the correct answer. Yeah! D. FTTH does not fit. Let's find out more. We are useless. The open with... out is FTTH, while others have mobile connectivity options. FTTH or fiber to the home is fixed broadband option. <laughs> right, let's get into our fourth question. It's on your screen, and the question is... Which statement is false? Is it A, only 2% of South Africans have access to the internet? B, Google is the number one most popular website in the world, followed by Facebook and YouTube? C, there are over 966 million websites in the world today? Or D, Bermuda has the highest internet penetration rate at 97.75%? 
A is false because all those others I'm pretty sure are true. One hundred percent true. Jeannie's saying A. Masasi, you agreeing with her? I'm saying D. I'm taking a point away from you. The answer Jeannie? is A. No. It is correct. Can Only two percent of South Africans have access to the internet. Bermuda is one of the most expensive places in the world to live. Oh wow! Cray cray. Okay. Yeah. okay. Want to know more? Check it out from my expert. <laughs> The false statement is definitely A. According to research from May 2016, 51% of South Africans have daily access to the internet. With the rollout of broadband prioritized, this number is constantly on the increase. It's no wonder Bermuda is the fastest internet rate. It's like all that black hole that's there. It's kind of stealing all of our internet. Yeah, that's it's one of the most expensive places in the world to live. That's crazy. Sure. Amazing. Question number five is on your screen. What is this measuring? All right, it's there. What is <laughs> it measuring? My current My feet. Feet. <laughs> <laughs> Is it A, speed on a highway? B, internet download speed? C, speed of a remote control car? D, speed of a 747? I mean... I'm never driving that. Ever. <laughs> Come on, girls. Okay, Don't wait. Do the that, options are there. Because now we're under pressure. Oh. You both said it again. <laughs> Reveal your answers in three, two, one. B. B. Cool. B it is. 100% oh, correct. Yes. Internet download speed. Yay. Our experts got more. <laughs> the speed of the light is measured in megabits per second. This image shows the testing of a line in certain areas. Regular tests are done to compare networks. When we started providing broadband services, that is many years ago, before I was even born. The highest speed possible in SA were well below one megabits per second. Today, we will be pleased to know that OpenServe makes it possible to consumers to access speed up to 100 megabits per second in some areas. All right, to be honest, I'm not keeping up with your scores, but if I think about it correctly, it's winner takes all for this one, so it's a tie, all right? I'm gonna give this last point just to kind of clear the air. Question number six uh, is on your screen. It is. How much time does the average South African spend on the internet a day? 24 hours. Is it A, 14 <laughs> minutes, B, 4 hours, C, 5 hours, or D, 6 hours? Yo, that's close, eh? I wouldn't even know. No, I spend way more than that. I can't even Exactly. That. More than 6 hours I, a day? I, on the, I'm online more okay, than 6 hours a day. Okay, Masasa, take a guess for winner takes all? D. Dini, Dini, do you want to take a Dini. guess? It's Dini, it's D. Dini. <laughs> Dini, it's the D. <laughs> Which one do you want to take? It's D. Yeah, I'll go for the D. That answer is incorrect from D. both of you. What? In fact, I'm going to let you take one more guess because it is winner's take or one of you has to win. B, B, B. Dini's oh. already said it. B is correct. Four yeah, hours a day yeah. is what the average South African wears. Okay, Congratulations, Okay, but I Dini. spend 24 hours a day <laughs> online. <laughs> Let's go find more from our expert. Although some of us spend more time than we like to admit, recent statistics show that the average South African spend approximately four hours on the internet. Do you think that is a lot? Yeah. Clearly these two don't think it's a lot <laughs> at all. Congratulations, Jeannie. Round of applause. Our Yay! winner and our web whiz quiz. You're officially a whiz on the internet, all right? Thank you. After the break, more games in the Afternoon Express Loft. Not like this, however. We get to answer your questions live on the show. It is Ask the Presenters after these. OpenServe, South Africa's largest telecoms infrastructure provider.